Welcome to the Daily Dose of App Sheet. I'm going to be talking today about dereferences. So, dereferences are the easiest way to pull data from a row in another table into a new row that you're creating. Some pro tips for using dereferences is that, first off, the syntax is the name of the reference column in the current form or the current table that you're working in and the naming convention of the table that you're reaching into to pull the data out of. So example here is the customer name is a reference in our order table. And then customer address is the name of the column that we want to retrieve from the actual customer table. So pulling from the customer into the order. Another pro tip is that you can only pull data from the parent record in the table reference relationship. So let's say for instance, we have a database that has a customer and that customer has an order and that order has many order details. So if we're creating an order detail record and we wanna pull the customer address, well, normally we would try to like take this expression and say, okay, here's our reference column in the order detail table. Here's the name of the column we're looking up in the order table, which is the customer. And then we're gonna have another period and pull out the customer address from that and have kind of a three-step uh, equation. Now, the reason that doesn't work in AppSheet, well, actually, I don't know why it doesn't work in AppSheet. What we have to do in AppSheet to make it work takes a little more effort. And so we have to actually create a column in between. So somewhere in that top parent table, we have to pull from the grandparent element into it and store it there and then dereference it. So I'll show you an example. So here's an app like we just described. It has customers, orders, and order details. And in this order detail form, if we want to see, if we want to get the customer address, there's two ways that we can do it. So we can dereference uh, our order has a reference to the customer that order is attached to. And then we can optionally pull in some data that we want to use down the line, like the customer address. Let's say we know our order details are going to need this piece of information. We can dereference it here and then pull it into the order detail from an uh, dereference through the order. So like right here, we're pulling the customer address from the order. We have order ID dot customer address. Alternatively, we could pull the entire reference from our order. So we're referencing the customer here at customer name. We could pull that reference in to our order detail. So I've got a column called customer name set to type reference, referencing the customer table, and I'm pulling in the value from order ID dot customer name. And then dereferencing this column to get the computer address, which is the name of the customer address as it appears in the customer table right here. This form pulls from the parent table. This form pulls from the grandparent table. Both will work, whichever one seems most efficient to you. So quick recap of the feature, a dereference is the easiest way that AppSheet allows us to pull data from one table into another table. At Crew Technologies, we love helping people get great value out of AppSheet. We do that through offering professional services and helpful content like this. To stay up to date, like and subscribe, and we're always trying to improve. So leave us your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching.